This video is a brief overview of the changes that were made to the CVC OEI course design rubric in October 2018. The complete rubric can be found online at cvc.edu. Overall, the rubric was changed to eliminate redundancies, align its language with new changes to Title V related to distance education, some student services are specified, examples are provided, and changes were made to grammar as well as streamlining the accessibility section. The table of sections has fewer entries showing how the criteria have been combined. The unit objectives in Section A were edited to focus on learning units and the reference to modules was removed. Also, the reference to assessments in Section A was removed since it was redundant with Section C. And a note was included for there to be sufficient contents to meet objectives. Criteria were grouped together that relates to how the learning management system is used to support learning, and the reference to multimedia was cleared up. Examples are provided for learner support, and the name of A10 learning support was changed to better reflect the intent of that element. These criteria on institutional support were grouped together, and examples of student services were changed to include tutoring, counseling, and online readiness. Also, technology support was broadened beyond the instructor role. Section B was divided into instructor contact and student-to-student -student contact, which reflects changes in Title V and its inclusion of student-to-student -student contact. Regular effective contact among students was more clearly defined to reflect changes in Title V. No changes were made in Section C. For Section D on accessibility, the criteria were combined to make it a shorter list and to more accurately reflect the location of various criteria. More descriptive languages was added to each of the criteria, and checkboxes were added to indicate which of the areas of the course were checked for that criteria. Section E was eliminated, and elements of Section E were added to the Section D description. The role of the instructor and the institution for ensuring accessibility is more clearly described.